Yes, what's up? Come in, sit down, and shut the door. This Kate fiasco, Kate Gate, Kate conspiracy, it's just below. Listen, we are in the thick of this, and I don't know how Buckingham Palace, Buckingham Palace, I can't even talk. I'm so excited. Buckingham Palace is going to respond to this, y'all. TMZ is now walking back the Kate Gate. I repeat. The second in command at TMZ is now walking back that fake, which we all thought, Kate video outside Windsor Farm Garden. Who cares? Dead Prince Philip's place he stole from someone's ancestors. They are now walking back that video that the British media and Kensington Palace thought broke the internet. But baby, Twitter said not today. Sussex Squad said you better go play with someone else. Not today. Listen. We have the video. We are going to play it. He is second in command. You must hear what he has to say. But you guys, before we get into that, can we just say this? Can we just say this? And it needs to be said. One, Twitter detectives put it together. First of all, this Nelson Silva, we don't think that he exists. I think they did a Google on photographers, this and that, found the Nelson Silva, there's plenty of them. They did it to distract. The Kate looked 20 years younger than Kate. People thought that it was perhaps a uh, um, a, uh, a, a facelift. I said, uh-uh. Because even with a facelift, it wouldn't have healed that quickly. You know, you need like a few months for those scars to actually heal. Kate was swinging bads. She was alive. The first clue that that wasn't Kate was the fact that she looked happy around uh, William. William never lets Kate walk in front, ever. Kate has to fall like a little meek mouse. William is that insecure. Kate was swinging bags, but she was fresh off of abdominal surgery. Nothing matched up. Even, it just didn't match up. And now we have confirmation from TMZ that the more they look like, look at it, the more they look at it, the more they're convinced that maybe it was lookalikes, but they're even going to say, then what does that say about Kinson and Palace? You guys, Kinson and Palace are, you know what? Let me let you watch the video and then meet me on the other side because Kinson and Palace are madmen. They literally played TMZ just like they paid the Associated Press and gave them fake videos that was set up through the sun. Because don't forget, the Sun is William's paper. That woman that left that article about Meghan Markle, that Jeremy Clark, yeah, they're honoring her. That is William's team. Camilla has the Daily Mail. William has the Sun. The Sun did a joint exclusive, shared it with TMZ, and this looks like, at least to me, let me know what you think, and listen to what he has to say, like another Frankenstein photo. They gave a fake video to TMZ about Will and Kate lookalikes. And it sounds like to me that TMZ is co-signing. Let's roll tape, right? And then meet me after the jump because, baby, we got so much to discuss. The House of Windsor has fallen. Fingers crossed. The House of Windsor has fallen. There is nowhere left to go. Watch this video. Okay. Uh, I have gone back and forth uh, three different times. I've looked at this video so often, and um, yeah, I, I, I got interested. Like, of course, it was her. But then I started looking at some of the comments and things that people are posting about why they don't think it's her, and they have some points about her height, about her height compared to William, where uh, her eye line is when she's looking at him normally, um, some things about her chin. There are a lot of different details that people have picked out, even in the way she, this woman walks. Now I'm not, before I was, I would say I was 95. But even the Williams, some people are picking apart that maybe it's not him. I, it, 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 there's endless mystery behind this thing. And, and the bigger question is, if it's not her, then again, we're left with where is Kate? Um, and what is going on with her? So, and why would the palace be involved if they are in another sort of hoax to make us think that Kate is okay? Because there was the, the Mother's Day photo 
was such a blunder, why would they do it again? Oh, no, I don't Which know. Which is what made me think at first it was her. Because there's like, there's no way they do that again. They got caught the first time, they wouldn't do it again. I feel like but, every woman in London and in England are lining up to be a Kate Middleton <laughs> stunt double. <laughs> <or something. laughs> like that model, everything. I mean, what do you think needs to happen at this point, Charles? Y'all, that is as big of a walk back as you can to TMZ. TMZ is furious. Let's get into this. Henry the Eighth, that's Sussex Henry Eighth on uh, Twitter. Make sure you follow him. Sussex Henry the Eighth, you know, V33123 uh, Roman numerals. They don't admit it's a lookalike, but this is TMZ walking the video back. To a degree, the palace is refusing to confirm. What a mess. Remember when we said earlier, you guys aren't confirming? That can't be Kate. Y'all. Michelle Gaines said, TMZ is usually on point about what they post, but if they're walking this back, then they know it's not there. Henry VIII said, it is interesting that they're commenting on it now. Maybe they just want to be part of the drama. Who knows? Listen, I don't believe that. TMZ actually, even though I do call them tabloids, they take, when they stand on something, they take pride at being the first and having sources, usually in the police department, fire department, and whatnot. The fact that he is out saying, the more I look at it, the more it looks like a, a, a lookalike, they would not literally do that to be part of drama. TMZ is the drama. Anyway, uh, HFM of Clam FM said, can't be her, sir. She's smiling, bouncing, walking faster than a shop litter, lifter and has a different face. Listen, the fuzzy cam says it all. If you guys don't know, there is this Twitter theory that I believe Kate's ears are bigger than they normally are. You can have an ear rejection, but not an ear expansion. On top of that, her height, her height doesn't match. Her height doesn't match. Listen, they said TMZ didn't know, but they paid someone a lot of money for this fake lol. I don't think TMZ paid. I believe that the son paid and they shared an exclusive with TMZ. Oh, this is bad for kids in the palace. And we love to see it. You guys, this is vindication. They said this whole thing is self-inflicted, ca uh, castro catastrophic mess. But this video seals the deal. The British monarchy will never recover from this. Dr. Strange says, that was, first of all, Kara Casanova. Dr. Strange, PhD, cat lackey said, something's wrong, really wrong. Terry Bennett said, so why is Kensington Palace allowing them to hang out to dry? Because that's what they did with the Associated Press. Kensington Palace doesn't care. It's run, it seems like, by a bunch of sociopaths. He sent a big message with his high-resolution picture today. That was uh, Charles. Is it that William doesn't have access to Kate? Kensington Palace can't be prosaic. I'm not a Brit, so maybe I'm not understanding something. Maybe I'm not a Brit either, Terry. But one thing I do understand is Kate's not coming to the phone. Whether it's because she doesn't want to or she can't, she's not coming to the phone. Sounder said, kind of hard for them to sell. She won't be available in June. If they confirm it was her power walking and carrying large bags, not just carrying, swinging them and laughing and joking. Too bad for them, their friends in the media already confirmed it by putting it in their rags. Only pick they didn't touch was the one with her mom. But I don't know about that because I have five wills. Olivia Miles said, I really, really hope it isn't her because it would mean she didn't disrespect her regiment. I have hopes, however, how, however far they've fallen, it's not that far. But why is it the palace can't, uh, the palace can't be silent? Was it or wasn't her? Again, why won't the palace actually admit was it you, Kate, or was it not? Um, laugh out loud. Hollywood said, I just don't understand why there isn't more than one video if she was out in public. Like, I get that people who live around the place, palace, usually don't take pics of them. But since we're currently witnessing Gone Girl in real time, I bet those same people would document it. This is an interesting thing that came up on Twitter when they said that even though they wouldn't have pulled their cameras out for whatever reason, maybe, I think someone would have snuck, walked up to her. Nobody walked up to her. Nobody said hi. There was no security around. But get this, they said the local Facebook boards, which literally they're always talking whenever they see celebrities. And they think that the, that the, um, the Waleses are huge celebrities, right? Nobody mentioned they even saw Will and Kate. Not on the boards, not on the gossip boards, not anywhere, not in Twitter threads. This was not Kate. It wasn't. 
And now even TMZ saying the more, this is the number two at TMZ saying the more he looks at it, but you have to think why would the palace put that out there? Listen, um, Tom Campbell said, are people in the UK so disinterested in Will and Kate that they can't be bothered to glance in their direction? If I had been there, I would have been gawking and taking my own photos. Exactly. Let's also not forget that this person, Nelson Silva, he's not, we, I don't even think this person exists because we can't find him. I know somebody found this one photographer on LinkedIn. He actually issued a press release and said, I am not that Nelson Silva. I don't think this person exists. Let's also not forget, right? That um, when all this happened, they did it to disquiet. Again, Kensington Palace is playing in our face and their whole strategy just blew up. Because remember I said this little blitzkrieg that they're doing? It only works if you're not hiding the truth. If you're hiding the truth, baby, it will never happen. Um, they said FAFOs applying internal and externally for the Royals. Once you break trust, man, that ish is not regenerated overnight, if ever, at all. Another person said they should just stop. Let's also not forget that the Queen's photo that Kate took. For, can we just all acknowledge now that Kate doesn't take any pictures? This whole thing about her being an amateur photographer, I think it's all bullocks. I don't think she takes the kids' pictures out, but that picture of the kid with her grandchildren, it was all manipulative generated. They made another Frankenstein pic of the Queen and all her grandchildren just so we could they could be cruel and show that Archie and Lilibeth weren't included so they could hurt Harry. Oh, it's not over. They are dragging them. They are dragging them. Um, where else? TMZ is doubling down that they don't think that's Will and Kate. Listen, somebody said with the palace, how do they keep digging deeper? Is the truth really that horrific? So in a modern day justice turning pest actually um, commented, um, uh, Ashley said, seems like it's either not them or it is them. And Kate's apparent health and ability to carry a large bag in the video cast doubts on the surgery needed recovery time that Kensington Palace has been broadcasting. That's the one thing. It's like you turned yourself um, into either liars or that's not you. Another person said, um, this is getting beyond ridiculous in the poor uh, at this part that was christine gala katia said whoo their pr department is horrible at all this holly said that's because it wasn't her spring said they should just stop laura like style watch bravo said what the h is going on kara said they just keep digging that hole absolutely bonkers michelle w said that was hardly a lookalike uh lewis bromwell literally just put clown emojis Woo! listen they said William and Kate, Ego said William and Kate have destroyed the royal family and to think they were they were also accusing Princess Meghan of doing that. Now Kinsen Palace has the same credibility as North Korea. It's a damn shame. Remember when I said, when you catch people in several lies, not their opinion, not speculation, but when they tell you, I swear this is the truth and you catch them in a lie more than once, baby, it's a done, it's a wrap. Once, maybe you lost your mind two times. You think I'm a believe once? When you catch someone lying, maybe they lost their mind. Give them a chance, right? Even honest people might steal a pack of gum. But after you caught them two times in a row, baby, you might have lost your mind the first time. I haven't lost, I'm not having lost my mind the second. They passed and said, guys, open your eyes wide. Remember the names of all those journalists who participated in this shameful propaganda. The way these people lecture us by being condescending, these people think we are idiots. They do. Jojo said, this is show was very entertaining. I agree. La Biblioteca said, and all over something that probably isn't that significant. How are they this up? See, this is the only thing I'm going to say. I do think that it's, um, I do think that they lied because it's one, uh, listen, I think that, um, they're hiding. When you see people call and said dumb, simple lies over and over and over, you have to start thinking it's because you're hiding the ugly truth. Kate is not available. Kate is not around. And all this mess that the Kings in the Palace did, baby! Long live that monarchy. You got more, two more years. George, I hope you're saving up for college because baby... <laughs> 
you're not going to be the king's son for that much longer. Anyway, right? Let me know what you think in the comments. TMZ has spoken, baby. What else do you want? I'll talk to y'all later. This is going to be a heavy upload day, but I am uploading other videos too. I'm making them right now because I know we can't do all royal all the time, but baby, this was too good to pass up. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.